Okay, so, uh, might do a better video later, maybe another one while I'm a little bit more, when I'm a little bit more, uh, done with the project, and, uh, sorry for the mess, but, uh, I just haven't cleaned my room yet, and I really wanted to get this, uh, video just while I had everything out. So, this is, uh, my fish tank taken apart. I've, all I need to do now is get the filter that was lost by the school. Jeez. And, uh, so, this is the back, and, uh, this is what holds the fish tank itself. You, uh, I cut this out, and I used an old door hinge. Then you feed the fish here, that's where the f filter goes when I get it again. And, uh, so yeah, the fish tank, this, made out of plexiglass. And, uh, after about three tries, I finally got this damn uh, sealant to work. And, uh, it holds about seven liters of water. So, you know, not gonna hold anything more than, uh, some tetras. But, uh, so that slides right into here that way I have fish tank separate that I can just remove and clean when I need it to be and this is the front panel all it does is uh, it slides on and off let's see if I can get it on with one hand And, uh, so that stays on, I'll, you'll end up, uh, screwing in two, three, maybe four if you really want to, screws, and then that'll hold everything tight, and it'll keep the fish tank from moving around. And, uh, you just unscrew it, and that'll slide off just fine, even when the fish tank's, uh, inside of it full of water. I'll try that out for sure. And, uh, this is the new 4-inch light I got. It's just four LEDs. It's pretty bright. I won't show you right now because I'm going to plug it into everything. I'll show you more when I have this mounted and everything. But what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to get an extension cord going from there up hanging here so that if any water drips down, then uh, uh, it'll only drip to about here. It won't hit the electrical socket, which, you know, would suck. But... This didn't come with an on-off switch, which sucks, but it gives me a reason to use this, which will be sick. And uh, in order to do that, I have this, which I took from an old, uh, let's see if you can get a good look at it. It sucks with the video light on, I know, but this thing performs horribly in darkness, so I gotta do it. And uh, so this is from an old record player that my electronics teacher was throwing out and oh, it fits snugly right here and even at just this distance when this is pressed it presses that to give it a toggle it'll be on or no actually that'll yeah this will be off and this will be on and it toggles it on and off and it fits perfectly just under here which is exactly where I need to be okay now it's supper's ready so we'll be down in just a sec but what I'm going to do is I'll place this about here at the front at the top so you're not staring at the light if you ever look into the fish tank this will run down the side and it'll splice this will splice into here and it will control one of the uh, you know, either the positive or the negative lines it doesn't really matter which as long as I get them correct when I connect it back up and uh, this will leak out the bottom and it will be able to attach to the other half of it so that when I need to take the fish tank apart all I need to do is unlatch it and then I can pop the front off with the light coming off too and I don't have this dangly wire laying around and I get a power button that's done with this. It'll be fantastic. And if maybe if I have time and some extra wattage laying around, I'll uh, maybe I probably won't, but maybe I'll get a circuit to go here so it's 
green when there's power but it's not on or green when there's power and it's on and amber when it's uh there's power but it's not on which of course will look freaking sick now I've still got the LEDs laid out everything on here is made for show but this is the only one that's left any of its functionality but yeah I uh, really can't wait to get this done get some neon tetras clean it up and it's really gonna look sick granted I wish I had a better place for it but what you gonna do? Alright, thanks for watching.